This video shows us how they used to make ropes back in the day. Now, when I first saw this video, I, I thought this guy was beating someone's ass straight out. But it turns out he's actually beating down what looks like some long grass. I'm not fully certain on what he's using. Back in the day, they used to use all kinds of stuff in this process. Sometimes it's plant fibers, animal hair, vines, even leather strips and reeds and grass. And the technique typically involves twisting and braiding these materials together to create a desired length and strength. So the choice of material and the thickness of rope would depend on the specific application, whether it's being used for agriculture or construction or sailing or whatever your purpose is. And the way that this guy's doing it remained the common choice for ropes until synthetic materials like nylon or polyester became popular in the 20th century due to the strength and durability and resistance of those materials. But I gotta say, this must have been a workout doing this day in and day out back in the day. And this guy weaved a mighty fine rope, if you ask me.